You look great. You, you look, look so great. So if there was a costume contest, you would win the whole thing. Not even for age range, the whole thing. Friends, today we are doing, today we're doing that. Today we are gonna do a DIY, DIY? Do it yourself. Wow, you know it's bad when you don't know what those letters stand for. Yay, mom brain! I was not gonna dress up little man. Come say hello. I wasn't gonna dress up CJ for Halloween because originally Adam was like, like, do we need to? He's not gonna remember. And instead of doing a Halloween photo shoot with him, I did a fall photo shoot with him. The pictures came out adorable. I have them all on my Instagram. If you want to go look, I put all the pictures that I did. Everything was from the dollar store. I totally forgot to film it. I will do, I'll film and vlog my Christmas photo shoot because my sisters thought that this was professional and it wasn't. I got everything from the dollar store. I think I spent like six or seven dollars and he looked adorable. So the pictures are on Instagram, including the fails that are equally as adorable, row underscore Clausen on Instagram. But I did have a onesie that has a hood and the whole thing has like blizzard scales like a dragon down the back. So I figured he could just be wear that and be a dragon for Halloween, even though I was still like a little heartbroken because you know me, I am like extra love holidays. And a couple of days ago, Adam said, we have to dress him up for Halloween. Why don't we recreate the picture? The picture is Adam's favorite picture that I sent him while he was inside. I was like, I keep this in my wallet as inspiration to always be nice to the little girl in me. When I was five years old at my birthday party, I remember specifically it was my five-year-old birthday party. I was wearing my pink frilly dress and we were having a party outside, but then cake was in the basement and everybody was around the table and they were getting ready to give me my cake. And I said, hold on. And I ran upstairs and I put on my Wonder Woman underoos. Give me a like and in the comments if you remember underoos or if I'm aging myself. But my Wonder Woman underoos slash costume. And I came downstairs and I stood on the table and there was a picture of me standing on the table as Wonder Woman. And Adam loves this story. He loves the photo. If I, he told me it's on the shelves over here. So if I find it, I'm going to pop it in right now in the video. But he always tells people that story about me standing on standing on a table dressed as Wonder Woman. And I'm like, can you clarify that I was five? Because, uh, I mean, we do live in Vegas now, but... Anyway, he said, well, why don't we make him Superman so we can recreate my favorite picture? And I was like, yes! Oh my God, Daddy getting down with the Halloween spirit. I am so down. You don't have to ask me twice to be extra on holidays, especially now that we have Little Man. Right, Little Man? You know, mommy's crazy. So I looked up Halloween costumes, Superman for kids his age. Now, but mind you, this is October 26th when this happened. Everything that was cute or in his size was sold out, unavailable until early November or just like $40 for something he will only wear once. So I'm like, I can create it. I can make it. First of all, I have been feeling so creative lately. I want to get back with that. In, in touch with my creative side. The last time I really was able to be creative creative was when I decorated and created the nursery and I did like the shadow box. And to me, that's all creative. And I do that with my YouTube videos, but I'm only down to one a week, if that at this point. So I'm not really getting fulfilled with that creative side. I did the nurse's baskets, but really that was the very last time I was able to do that. I always made my youngest two sisters Halloween costumes when they were little. They're 10 years and 13 years younger than me. I found so much joy in that. I've always loved that kind of stuff. I taught myself how to embroider when I was in seventh grade, I think. I taught myself how to hand stitch. I taught myself cross stitch, all kinds of stuff. I just haven't done it in years. When I left for college, I remember specifically my two little sisters standing in the driveway in front of the garage door, doors, teeny tiny little things, like eight and five, crying. And they said, who's gonna make our Halloween costumes now? And it just broke my heart so much, so hard. And when I came home, I remember when I moved back from college, they were like high, junior high and high school age. So I made one of these gorgeous, 
butterfly wings out of hangers and I went to Michael's and I got feathers and I made them in all different colors and they were beautiful and she won the costume contest that year. So I feel like I'm back. So we are going to make a DIY Superman that is going to be cuter than any other Superman costume you've ever seen in your whole entire life. Not only because I made, made it, more importantly, because this little cutie is going to be rocking it. What do you think, See, Are you excited? Are you excited? So we're going to take you along on the vlog. Before we get started, really quick, this really comfy, adorable cardigan that comes in so many colors is going to be listed in the description box with links. That and also this bra has a sports bra bra, a sports bra back, a sports bra bra. Well, somebody asked me on one of my last videos where I got it from because they wanted to get it. It does have nursing clips. So it's a nursing sports bra. I've worn it to work out. It's great. I've actually worn it in the pool before. So it's great for everything. It's from Target and it's the Audin brand, A-U-D-I-N. And I think it's like between 16 and $20. Not a lot. It's the only color I have. It's cute. It's ribbed. I'm going to try to get it in more colors. I do have to go back to the store to get a couple more things to complete the costume. Really quick, let me show you what I have so far. Little C, you want to hang out for one second? Let's see if we can get him over here. Yay! Yay! I feel like my back is starting to look good again. I'm starting to like work out hard and kind of watch what I eat, but not drastically. I'm still breastfeeding. I'm still eating way more calories than usual, but I'm just kind of like toning it down. Like Adam and I were going nuts at one point where when I started eating meat again, I didn't just dip my toe back in the pool. I jumped head first. So I'm starting to cut that back because I only really added it because I was really anemic when I was pregnant. When I got my gestational diabetes test, it came back that I was severely anemic. My ferritin was low. So I started eating meat then, but we would get jalapeno poppers and we would get steaks and hamburgers all the time. And Adam is like a meat and potatoes guy. He would eat red meat seven days a week, three times a day if he could. Hey, little man, he's so happy and laughing right now. Do you want to show everyone your smile? Mm. So there's no reason for me to have to do that. I am definitely keeping it because I'm breastfeeding, but I don't need to eat it a few times a week. Once a week is fine. I don't eat bacon all the time. I'm cutting it back, I'm working out a little more, and things are going well. Okay, babbled enough, like always, yay! So what we need for this Halloween costume is, first of all, I went to Carter's and I got a onesie. This came in a pack of three, I'll show you guys. Originally like 30 something dollars, but I got all three for under 18. So I think with tax and everything, they were like, five dollars each maybe a little bit more i'm just telling you the price because we'll total this at the end i think the whole thing cost me like ten dollars maybe no maybe like under fifteen dollars where if you were buying this online it would be like 40. you don't need to spend 40 dollars on a baby not only that i just enjoy it and it's unique and okay enough so we got this blue onesie it's not necessarily the perfect color blue for superman but it's not not, it's like the original oh. Superman. Okay, oh. we're gonna go with that. Oh, and I, I printed this guy on my printer. He was going to be kind of my guide, but I ran out of ink. So that's on the list of what we're gonna get at Walmart too. I need printer ink because obviously my red ink is out. Went to Michael's and I got felt. I got one large piece of felt for the cape. This was a dollar, less than a dollar fifty, like a dollar and change. What do you think about this? Peekaboo, you love that? Oh. Okay, and then I got these three small pieces of felt pre-cut. They were like 39 or 49 cents each, maybe less. Yeah, maybe like 30 something cents, 29 cents. I don't remember, but we got red and yellow to do the Superman logo that we're going to cut out and put on the onesie. This particular pattern that I found came with a Superman mask. So we have black to make the mask and then black ribbon. The pattern I found had gold ribbon, which I thought was really cool, but Adam came with me to Michael's. I forgot to film that day. We were in such a big rush. He had to get in and get out and get onto a work meeting from the car. So we didn't have time to film. God bless you, my love. So he wanted black, we got black, that's fine. And then I have Gorilla Glue and I have E6000. I don't know which one I'm gonna use. They'll both be perfectly fine. I do have a sewing kit that came from the dollar store. I threw it in a Ziploc bag just so I didn't lose the little spoolies, spools, spools of thread and needles. 
So just in case we need to stitch anything, I have some fabric scissors that we're gonna keep far away from the baby. A Superman pattern that I was gonna trace on there and cut out, we'll do together. But this came out way too big. So either I'm gonna have to kind of like use this and freehand, or I'm gonna have to print a smaller version, tried, and this is what came out out of ink. Hence needing to go to the store to get some more ink. This was a pattern for if I wanted to create booties, but I think what I'm gonna do is just, if I can at Walmart, find red knee socks to create boots. He has a pair already of socks that I could pull up to his knee and they're oh, thick stripes of brown and this same color red. So if I can't find anything or like, I'm not spending $20 on a pair of pink socks for the big, I'm sorry, red socks, knee socks for the baby that he'll never wear again. So I'm sure I have something in the house. If not, the pictures that I saw online are definitely doable. They're all adorable. And a lot of them just show the naked baby feet, which are equally as cute. Okay, that's what we have for now. That's what we're doing. And we are gonna run to the store. We're gonna get changed and we're gonna run to the store. Do you wanna say goodbye, we'll be back? Do you wanna say goodbye, we'll be back in a few minutes? Here, say bye guys. This is my mini me. Literally this face, my sisters call him, honey, I shrunk my mom. Ready? Mwah! This is so exciting! Oh, what do you think? What do you think? You look great. You, you look, look so great. So if there was a costume contest, you would win the whole thing. Not even for age range, the whole thing. I was looking for all red socks and uh, they didn't have any suit. No, I love the suit. Do we? Red. I don't yes. know if they're going to stay on. They're like 18 months. I love them. I think that's all they had. But oh, these are, maybe they These don't. are very cool. Very cool. Well, he has like two-year-old feet. This is true. Right? You've got like a two-year-old feet. Look at these things. Wow. Listen, that's a compliment. Such a compliment. The girls are going to be happy. Oops, I didn't say that. <gasps> I did not say that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Now, the, they, the way that they did the belt, it looks like boots. Perfect. Oh, buddy. So good. There's some single girls there. So pants. good. Can you say Sam? Hold on, are you, is he wearing pants or no? No pants. No pants. Pants is part of the charm. Okay. In the Naughty Claws fashion. I think mom, I think mom definitely hooked your cape up. Yeah, made it a little too short though. No, 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 no. it's gonna work just perfect. Dad, hold them, I need to take a picture. <laughs> but wait, let's do this. You don't have this on video? It's videoing, but. Okay. Yeah, I was gonna say tie and then. You are the cutest thing I've ever seen. You First, are. let's get the video. Oh my God. Look. He looks like he's trying to fly. like a dork and you can't hear it on the video. Hi. Oh. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Yeah. So close. So close. 